Hallo zurück bei Life is Strange. Wir haben den Laptop durchsucht von David. Moment. Ich werde erstmal kurz die SMS lesen. Das ist ja nett. Wenigstens keine Droh-SMS. Nice breakfast. David, you, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Der verdächtigt doch jetzt bestimmt uns. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras, so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the, that's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even hit your stepdaughter. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Chloe's doing drugs. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day. Clay, for once. Just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Ja, tut mir leid, aber äh, Chloe ist meine Freundin, deswegen halte ich natürlich zu ihr. Sprechen? Nee, ich traue mich nicht, den anzusprechen, oder soll ich versuchen? I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. Aber was wäre denn passiert, wenn ich zu ihm gehalten hätte, statt, statt zu Chloe? Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. <lacht> nee, ich werde es auch dabei belassen, weil wie gesagt, sie ist meine Freundin. Also selbst wenn ich jetzt irgendwie Ärger kriege mit der Schule, aber Also ich hoffe natürlich, ich werde nicht suspendiert deswegen. Das wäre natürlich scheiße. Aber grundsätzlich, wenn ich jetzt in der Situation gewesen wäre, hätte ich natürlich auch äh Eher zu meiner Freundin gehalten als zu der ihren Stiefvater. Als ich durch Davids Laptop ging, fand ich Bilder von Rachel und Frank. Sie waren 
more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything, for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. Was ist der denn da? Brei? Oder? I can't can believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Locked. Ach so, ja, irgendwas mit dem Schlüssel. Ich habe nämlich jetzt gerade kurz nicht aufgepasst. I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. Ja, das letzte Mal, als ich hier zum Diner ging, da wurde mir gesagt, äh, ich hätte mich hier noch umsehen können. Ich hätte noch einiges finden können. Mal sehen, ob ich das nachholen kann. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Oh, eine Nachricht vom Papa. Ja, was schreibt denn der gute Papa? Wenn du zum Relaxen nach Hause kommst und hier auf eine Schule gehen möchtest, steht dir steht die Tür immer weit offen. Es war hart hier, ich bin noch nicht so weit nach Hause zu kommen. Aber es ist ein lieber Papa. Was ist das hier für ein Typ? Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? The tornado? Ja. <lacht> I hope not. Could be worse. We could get one of those California quakes. True. Well, I'm feeling a little dizzy now. Um, hope you catch the big one today. I better. Too late to switch careers now. See you around, kid. Also jetzt äh, angeln, so das wäre auch nicht mein Ding, muss ich sagen. Ach ja, diese typische USA-Straße hier so. Kriege ich immer gleich wieder Sehnsucht. Der wirkt auch so ein bisschen suspekt. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of goddamn Arcadia Bay. The whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, that slut suicide. Listen, Kate Marsh was not a slut. She was severely depressed for good reasons. You didn't even know her, did you? I know all these black well spoiled shit. Like mm. that other loser I'd see around here. Rachel. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you black well turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Ja, was ich jetzt sowieso eigentlich noch mit dem quatsche. Oder Moment mal, kann ich da was zurückspulen? Und, und, und. Das würde mich jetzt allerdings mal interessieren. Falls es euch jetzt nervt, aber ich, äh... Mach's jetzt einfach. Dann könnt ihr ja vorspulen, wenn hey, ihr es nicht going? sehen wollt, aber... Ich bin gespannt, interview ob wir was over. ändern können. Actually, 
I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18-wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? Hmm. I took a Blackwell class on the history of truckers. I always wanted to drive a rig on the road. Finally, a Blackwell student with brains. Next time I get a local job, I'll let you ride along. Take care. Oh, it's why I'm on Tick Nettle. Yes, another great day in Arcadia Bay. Plötzlicher Schneefall oder Sonnenfinsternis steht uns die Apokalypse bevor. Ja, Schülerin springt, springt an der Blackwell Akademie öffentlich in ihren Tod. Also ich finde, da muss das wirklich schon sehr, sehr schlimm sein mit einem, wenn man wenn man vom, vom Dach springt. Ist er tot? So ominous. Also das würde ich aber nicht fotografieren, muss ich ehrlich sagen. Einen toten Vogel finde ich jetzt nicht so attraktiv. Obdachlose. Hi, how are you? Well, I'm homeless. Otherwise, yeah, fantastic. Who are you? Max. Can I get you something from the diner? I heard about that girl killing herself at Blackwell. Mm, awful thing. Kate Marsh. I was with her when she jumped. I tried to save her. I swear I did. Oh, honey. That was her choice, not yours. Don't you carry that weight. I know. I'm starting to see that I can't change everything. Especially when it comes to other people. Kate Marsh probably felt like she had nothing no more. I know the feeling. But I need to find out who else is involved in this. I'm probably a bigger snoop than you. People pretend to not see me. So I see everybody. And everything. I fuck up to Frank and Frank Bowers knew Rachel. Have you seen him around? I heard him bragging that he took a gun from some trespasses. I don't know how he hasn't been arrested yet. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. Not <coughs> good. Mal gucken, ob ich hier noch irgendwas finde. Alte Waschmaschine. Also welche, die, die, die so richtig Obdachlose, die können einem echt leid tun, aber man weiß immer nicht, ob welche richtig Obdachlos sind oder ob die halt nur so tun, um Geld zu kriegen, um sich zu besaufen und so. Das gibt's ja oft genug. I don't want to go that way. So hätte sein können, dass da noch irgendwas ist, aber gut, dann gehen wir mal in das Diner. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Ugh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Es ist ausverkauft. Ich habe uns Tickets organisiert. Musste dafür ein paar Typen verscheuchen. Vor allem Kate antwortet überhaupt nicht. Ich 
glaube nicht, dass Kate wirklich ernsthaft das Interesse an ihm hat. Verteilen. Ich muss ihn ja Dein Teller ist immer noch nicht leerer geworden. Ach, Bohnen sind das. Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Mm. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer. Or even Nathan. And then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Was ich soll hier irgendwie anquatschen? How you doing, Maxine? I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Hmm, nix über Frank. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. Makes me sick thinking about it. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. <laughs> I better finish my breakfast first. Ich weiß nicht, ob ich da jetzt was ändern kann. Also ich finde es interessant, wenn man sich mit denen fertig unterhalten hat und dann kann man immer noch was ändern. How you doing, Maxine? Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Der, oh, der guckt ja unheimlich. Oh, muss ich jetzt wirklich mit dem Typen sprechen? Der ist ja so furchtbar. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Drogen im Angebot? I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. 
Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. So a whore. This is so a miscal. Rachel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have I done was? Ob's da noch, uh... Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Okay, ich mache jetzt hier aber erstmal einen Stop und wir sehen uns im nächsten Part wieder.